Hey guys, welcome to my next video. So I thought I'd do a lorry tour for you today. I know I've been promising to do it for quite a long time, um, but I've only just got round to it, especially as the weather's so nice. So this is my Oakley Supremacy. It's a 26 ton truck. It takes four horses. It's got a double pop out side and a pop out shower. Um, and it's honestly, shows going to shows, especially away shows, when I'm quite often away for a week or two at a time, wouldn't be the same without this truck. And I know I'm very lucky to have it. So I'll take you guys on a tour of it. Um, I'll take you around the outside first because there's quite a lot of bits on the outside that I want you to see as well as the exciting parts on the inside. Let's go! So this is the back jockey door. It goes into the horse area and all the doors are by code. Um, so you can kind of see in there. If we need to get to the horses, if we're on the ferry or whatever and we can't get in the lorry, then we can go in this way and check that they're fine. This is the tack locker, but we also use it for feed or tack for everyday shows um, and yeah and then we saw things in there as well it's nice to have the tack locker that's actually quite large and in here is rugs, brushes, there's also a speaker system that can connect to your phone by bluetooth um, and it plays speak out, music out the speakers um, so again another storage area um, it's really useful here we have a freezer so this is where I keep my ice boots or any extra food or ice cream <laughs> um, if we don't have space in the freezer in the living but yeah this is great for ice boots for like the horses if they're dirty or whatever and we don't want it in the food freezer in here is a washing machine and then storage and the wheelbarrow, rugs, everything in here um, and it goes all the way through to the other side and it's also heated so if we put the heating on in there we can put things like horse things in there like rugs, saddle pads, bandages, whatever to dry after they've been in the washing machine and in here it's more storage space and it's like the opposite to the other side. We've got saddle pads, I've got all my stable curtains and chairs in there. Same in here. In here is the generator um, and also the electric for the ramp because the ramp is electric and it comes down so we don't have to push it up and put it down when it's really heavy. So now I'll take you guys inside. I know that's the bit that you've all been waiting for so we'll go. So this is the door to the living and again it's controlled by panels so we don't have keys because keys always get lost if you ever need to lock it at a show or whatever. So. so this is the living, um, as you can see it's absolutely beautiful. Um, when it was being designed my mum actually designed it, she's really good with Kind of interior design and all kind of things like that she's got really good taste um so the first time i saw the lorry was actually the first time i had any idea of what it was going to look like she didn't really include me <laughs> she didn't really let me have any say in the matter she just said right i'm sorting it out i'm designing it so i just kind of left her to it so yeah it was a very nice surprise to see it look like this up here is the bed about a bed above the luton this is where i sleep for shows um, and then if you turn around, up there is Ida, my groom's bed, she sleeps up there. And then the sofa here also can turn into a double bed, it's like a pull out bed. The table goes down and then the bed pulls out from the back. Here we have a microwave and a really, really large fridge and freezer. Up here we've got a Wi-Fi box, Sky box, DVD box for when we're away. Um, and obviously a massive TV <laughs> and that comes that can go up or down so if you don't want the TV up if you don't want it in the way if you want a bit more light in then that goes down sink and I thought this is really cool that this comes up and down um, induction hob and then a gas oven which is great when you're away at shows for a very long time and something else that we have is a dishwasher which is so helpful because it means that you don't have to keep doing the washing up at shows as well. Um, and yeah, and I always like to keep it really tidy, Ida and I do when we're away because I think when you've got a lorry this amazing and this nice, it's kind of 
you know, you're not going to let it go messy and dirty and yeah, so kind of respect the lorry. <laughs> So this is the bathroom, it is absolutely massive, especially for a horse lorry bathroom. My old one was tiny and we were so cramped in. Um, this one is amazing, like, I mean, how many lorries have that much space? And the shower is really big and it's just absolutely amazing in here. The whole lorry, by the way, has underfloor heating, so in the winter, to get up and to be able to just get down on the floor and not be freezing cold is actually quite nice <laughs> especially when it's like minus five and you're at a show in the winter and it's icy outside and like the last thing you want to do is get up early and go outside in the freezing cold so to be able to come back in the lorry after that and it being warm and you can just oh it is honestly so nice so what's quite unique about the oakley lorries is that the door to the bathroom so it can close <laughs> and then it can like open up and it locks there and you can make it into like a bigger area like a bigger changing area or whatever and it also goes that way if you need it to so I that's something that I really like about this lorry so through this door goes to the horse area so when we're traveling to shows or when we're going on the ferry or whatever we always go and check them check the temperatures okay check that they're okay and just that they're happy eating and they've got enough hay or whatever so yeah it goes through there so this is the horse area uh, but for, to me, having a really nice lorry is all great if you've got an amazing living. But unless you've got a really nice area for the horses, it's not worth it. And this is something that I love about this lorry as well, is the fact that the, part the partitions are padded. Um, these clothes, I, I don't like it when you see lorries that are just open so that they're like this. And a lot of lorries have nothing here. So some horses will fight and bite and whatever, and I don't really like that. So I like the fact that you can close this. They can still see each other through the holes or whatever, but they also can't then steal each other's hay, which, I mean, okay, mine still do, but <laughs> it's not as easy for them. And the floor is also rubber, and it's really, really, like, squishy. So it's nice, it's like nice, when it's really bouncy in the lorry and the roads are not very good, it's a lot more absorbent than just normal flooring. Um, and then this is a water trough. You turn it on down there, and it can drain from here. So if you want to give the horses a drink when you're travelling and it's not very easy to climb under them with a whole bucket of water, um, you can give them a drink through here. And then there's windows and bars throughout the whole side of here and there's also windows there. And this whole area in the back of the truck is temperature controlled from the front so we can make it hotter, colder, there's fans for when we go on the Euro tunnel. Um, and then also Ida can get to her bed through here from up there and the, ho the whole horse area is also covered by a camera so we can check that everything's okay with them when we're traveling. So this is the cab, it's a uh, Scania um, and my amazing groom Ida drives the lorry, she's absolutely tiny so whenever we turn up somewhere and people see her getting out of it they're like oh my god like was she just driving that truck. It is absolutely huge, it is automatic as well so it is, I can move it around at home and it is very easy to drive. I just haven't taken my test license yet for HGV <laughs> um, but it's so comfy as well and all the seats are on air <laughs> so as you're driving along if it's bumpy then it's a lot more comfortable um, and yeah there's three seats here um, so we can fit more than just two people in here so I hope you guys enjoyed the lorry tour it's an absolutely beautiful truck and I'm, I know how lucky I am to have it I really really do um, I just don't know what I would do without it to be honest so if you like this video and you want to see more like it, please like and subscribe and you can also follow my Instagram.